about halfway through the first week of pre-season. Uh, how are you feeling and how's the body feeling to be back? Yeah, really good to be back in training and seeing some new faces at the club. Um, we've got a 12-week pre-season, so it's nice to get back up and running again. Um, obviously, the off-season wasn't ideal with uh, with lockdowns and whatnot, but um, yeah, it's nice to be back amongst the boys again. And how did you spend your time in that off-season? Uh, were you going to the beach, spending time with family? How did you spend it? Yeah, just at the beach, down Terrigal. Um, we had plans to go back to Perth, visit family, but obviously um, with the restrictions and whatnot, you know, um, we didn't manage to go back to Perth, but yeah, just being down the beach with the little one, with the family, spending uh, spending time with them and um, trying to keep busy with them, yeah. It's a good way to spend it. Yeah. But what about pre-season training? What is it you like the most and what is it you like the least about pre-season training? Oh, look, just being amongst the boys again. Um, you know, obviously we had a bit of a break. Um, but yeah, just to be amongst it, you know, with the players again, you know, the banter and... Um, you know, like, you know, football's, uh, you know, I love football, I love what I do, so to be out here, um, you know, with uh, with all this stuff going on around in the world at the moment, you know, it's nice to, to be back out on the field with your close mates and um, be back doing what we love, and that's, you know, playing football, you know, with a smile on our faces. And just personally for you, you've signed a new contract here at the Mariners, and um, what are your goals come the end of this season? Yeah, look, obviously... Um, you know, signing with the club for, for two more years. Um, you know, there's no other club that, you know, I want to play for. You know, I love the coast. Um, I love living here. I love the club. You know, I've built so many good relationships here at the club and, you know, outside of football as well. And, you know, I think it's important uh, for us these, for us this season is to, you know, take each game as it comes, um, you know, have a good pre-season, work hard, get fit, um, you know, because I think that was... Uh, you know, that was key to our performances last season, you know, especially earlier on in the season, um, you know, we were very fit. Um, but in saying that, just enjoying every day, you know, it's we've been back now for a week and, you know, there's a real buzz about this place. Everyone's got a smile back on their faces and um, really, looking see, really looking forward to the season ahead. Um, you know, it's 12 weeks, but, you know, that, that will come around quite quickly. Um, so hopefully we can... Uh, you know, get some pre-season games in, hopefully the FFA Cup goes ahead and, um, you know, get that click amongst the boys and uh, we'll be ready for for round one when it comes. Beautiful. And just finally, uh, a change in goalkeeping coach. We had Joyce last year. Now we've got Jess Van Stratton back. How are you feeling with him in the role? Yeah, no, very good. Obviously, I've got a, me and Jess go way back um, to Newcastle days. Uh, fantastic coach, fantastic guy and, you know, really good to have him back at the club again.